Your Daily Dough. Home baking without the hassle. Hi there guys, my name's Tom, co-founder of Your Daily Dough. I'm going to show you how to turn your pack of dough into four beautiful Neapolitan style pizzas. Here's what you're going to need to turn your dough into four beautiful pizzas. A high sided oven dish, a frying pan, some flour, scales, spatula, cling film. Let's get this done. I'm now going to show you how to remove your dough from the pouch. Cut along the side. Just want to be careful here to make sure we're cutting the top layer. Doesn't matter if you cut the dough. All the way down. And then taking your spatula and start scraping it along the top. There's no glamorous way of doing this guys. Just trying to get the dough out of the pack. And on to your work surface. And there we go. Good to go. We're now going to take our dough and turn it into four 200 gram dough balls. We're going to lightly flour our hands just to make it a bit easier to work with. I've got some scales here, but if you don't have scales guys, just eyeball it. You want four fairly evenly sized 200 gram dough balls. There we go. We're almost ready to make pizza. I'm now going to show you how to take your fresh cut dough and turn it into pizza dough balls. So what I'm doing right now is turning and tucking the dough in on itself. I then place it on the counter and give it a few turns with the palm of my hands to get some tension in the dough and a nice even round shape. Just rolling and tucking and then straight into our high sided dish to let it prove up. And there we go guys, cover with cling film and these bad boys should be ready to go in about two hours time. So as you can see, our pizza balls have almost doubled in size. We're almost ready to get rolling. So now we're gonna take some flour, lightly dust one of our pizza balls, and lightly dust our hands. Also, put a bit of dusting on the surface that we are gonna be rolling our beautiful pizza bases on. We're gonna work our way around the dough onto the surface. The idea now, guys, is to press all the air that we've got trapped in to the edges to create that beautiful crust. Eat your crusts, kids, they're good for you. So we just start working our fingers, turning the dough from the middle out. Turn the dough over and we keep going. Now these dough balls are gonna make around 10 inch pizzas. And then, Get the blades of our hands, just start gently stretching until we have a beautiful pizza base ready for topping. Now we've rolled out our base guys, we're going to transfer it to our hot dry frying pan to cook the base so you've got a nice and crispy pizza. We'll then transfer from the frying pan onto our wire rack, ready for dressing. Once all your base are prepared, now comes the fun bit, dressing your pizza. We're going for a classic here, the margarita, everyone's favorite. Spoonful of sauce into the middle of the base. Let's do two spoons. I like my pizza saucy. Spread it out to that beautiful aerated crust that we've created. 
And we're going in with our mozzarella next. About nice big chunks of mozzarella, guys. This is going to be absolutely excellent. Couple of leaves of basil. Now into the oven for 15 to 20 minutes and let the oven work its magic. Wow, look what you made guys. A few kitchen essentials, your YDD dough, and got yourself a beautiful Neapolitan pizza. Enjoy. Your daily dough. Home baking without the hassle.